Hello, everybody. My name is Mathis, and welcome back to some more of the Long Dark. Mmm. 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 Oh, that's so good coffee right there, fam. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Well, it's morning for me anyway. All right. Where are, are we looking good? We do, sun is setting. Um, I, I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure <laughs> if I wholeheartedly enjoy uh, the accessible interactions. So I can convert all press and hold to press actions. So what we had before. I think I'm gonna go for that. I'm not sure I like the new HUD. Um, and I, it's something I think I've, I, a lot of people have been kind of discussing, um, myself included, whether the new HUD is good or bad. The reason I don't know like the new HUD is that I, I, I think I, I understand the thought process behind the um, keeping everything kind of vague. So, you, you know, because if you are surviving in real life, you're not counting calories and weight, but there was a depth that was added when you could see the temperature in numbers, or you could see the calories you were burning in numbers. When you're presented with all of that facts, you kind of have this depth and survivability uh, in this game that allows you to micromanage. And this game, if anything, is more about micromanagement and, and the hardcore aspect of survival. Now, granted, I'm only one episode into the new update. And it's not like it's going to make the game bad or anything, because um, the game is still really good. But I, I miss being able to, to like hit a, hit a button, look at my numbers, and quickly evaluate what I need to do, when I need to do it, and how soon I need to do it. You could quickly change your priorities uh, if, if, if things were getting really cold outside. Instead of looking around for food, you may need to look for uh, shelter very, very quickly. Uh, and all of that being taken away, I don't know if it's going to change it too much, but like it's like instead of seeing like, oh man, it's like five degrees out, and having to go to a different menu and all that stuff, I can now I'm like, oh man, there's two, I'm um, going down two pips instead of one. It's just a, it, it's a, I feel like it loses something. Um, but oh well, we'll see how it goes. Again, I, I'm speaking purely out of 20 minutes of gameplay with this new update, so I could be incredibly wrong uh, in the long run. We'll see. So, all of that in mind, uh, something that people have said is, Math is you can pick up a rock and throw it, you know, uh, at, at rabbits to stun them and, and capture them. So, apparently I was passing rocks and I, I didn't realize people were like, kill me. You're passing all these rocks. I had no idea. I had no idea. So if there's rocks, I'm gonna try and like maybe try and smack a rabbit with a rock and see if I can capture him. Um, how are we looking on food, by the way? Why don't we actually go ahead and eat the fish that we ended up getting here? Yeah, we don't. We, no calorie counts. I don't like it. Add to radial. Oh, there might be like a. I can do um. This. Oh, the new radial menu is weird. Campcraft first aid. All right, interesting. Uh, I think it looks good. I think the radial. I do like the fact that they have gone this more artistic direction. Uh, that's something I think is is really cool. But overall, I, I I would prefer if they had done a mix. I would have loved to see not only you know the new artistic direction that they've taken. But also maintaining and keeping uh, all the detail that I got to, to kind of look at when I wanted to. I do love the new bodies, though. They look way better and way more detailed. That's great. This is really handy. Yeah, there's a, there's, a lot, there's a lot to love in this new update. There's no question about that. There's an absolute lot to love here. Um, and again, like I said, it doesn't make the game bad by any stretch. The game is a fan. It's... I still hold it as probably one of the, the best, if not the best, uh, like, pure survival game on the market right now. I say pure survival game because I mean no, no supernatural stuff like zombies and stuff. Just straight up survival. It's really, really cool. So I'm going to swing my way across here uh, and hopefully get to this other island. See if I can make that work. So these are rocks, apparently. I can equip it and just hurl a rock at somebody. I wonder if I can hit like a um, a wolf with it and like freak him out or something. I will try and hit a rabbit. I will give it a shot. This is cool though. I like it. Is there like a uh... hmm? How do I equip it? Weapons. Okay, it's it's under under weapons. That's fine. 
A lot of wolves on the water, but we're good. A lot of new graphical dis uh, changes as well. Like, these huts look a little different. Not drastically different, but just a little. Alright, let's see what we can get inside here. Uh, the frozen angler. I'll take it. A little bit of, um... Studying I can do. Is that new music? Don't think it's new. No, that's definitely not new. Yeah, the music actually reminds me of, uh, I think it's a rabbit. It reminds me of Minecraft, oddly. So I can aim it. Oh, damn. I have to aim it through my hand. Alright, bunny. I'm gonna fucking try and stun ya and grab ya. Gonna stun ya and grab ya. Yeah, chill out. You'll, you'll be alright. Ooh, shit. Damn it. <laughs> I have to arc upward. God damn it. Sorry, bunnies. I'm trying, though. Got it! Hell yeah! Oh! No! Oh, God! Oh, that is horrendous. Also, what is that little weird thing at the top? Oh, God. It's so sad. It's so sad. I don't know what that little thing at the top means, but it's, I'm also like, oh, he was a little sniffing me. He was sniffing my little, my face, man. He was just so, okay. All right, you know what? Let's go, fam. Yeah, you want to fucking go? Oh, no, oh, slashing, slashing. What the fuck? It slowed down. What the hell was that? I had a desperation or a slashing. I tried to throw a rock at it. What's with the music? Okay, there goes the wolf. Is he gonna die? I'm hoping he dies. I'm actually going to follow him and see what happens. I lost him? Nope, there he goes. Alright, well, never mind. I was hoping he was going to die, but I'm not going to follow him too far. I just wanted to come here. All right, we're the misanthropes homestead. I didn't really take any damage there, so I don't understand how that what that was about. But we're actually super cold now. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to cook until the morning. Unharvested rabbit carcass, uh, harvested for usable meat. Bet you feel bad for killing this little guy. Yeah, of course I do. Why would I not feel bad about it? Let's go ahead and harvest him. I'm sorry, bunny bro. Now he's gone. And so is my light. I don't understand what this is. Is this like, I feel bad for killing animals? Because that's stupid, if that's true. Let's hope that's not what it is. I like the new, I like the new noises. Ooh, I think it looks different now, actually. Work boots, not gonna worry about it. All right, let's do a quick loot. Um, I'd love to get uh, a sewing kit soon. Then I can feel comfortable ripping up all the old stuff. Speaking of, um, and we can do some clothing repair while we're here. And we get, looks like we got inside kind of just in time. If this is any good to eat. I'm sure it's fine to eat, dude. No, no, no. Little dangly bits, man. I like how it wobbles now. 
I honestly don't know what that freaking thing at the top means. I killed a rabbit, alright? Like, it sh showed up after I killed it. What do you want? Like, in a normal survival situation, are you really gonna feel super bad about killing a rabbit? You might feel bad for a little bit, but if it's that or star- or starvation... Could end up being useful. Hitting a rabbit with a rock so you can survive and then killing it is not that big a deal. You gotta do what you gotta do. Gamey venison meat, that's actually excellent find. We're a little over encumbered now, but that's all right. We're gonna take care of that soon here. Okay, Maya, what the fuck are you doing? Oh, you have the zoomies. You're zooming. I can see it. You know, I know, Maya. I can see it in your face. Your eyes are wide. We here. You're going crazy. Okay. Some tea. All right, now I'm suddenly, I have two pips. Uh, let's put that there, I guess. I don't know what that means, man. What do the pips even mean, bruh? All right, let's actually go ahead and uh, let's actually rip this up. Taking my time. And then we're gonna actually go ahead and repair. No, 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 no. I'm not harvest. Why can't I repair it? Take off? No. Where? Maybe I just need more stuff. So. Uh, 99%. Let's go ahead and uh, wear these. I can repair those, actually. I should wear them, dual layers and stuff. Slightly better? Because what am I wearing right now? Those ragged sport socks. Climbing ragged socks. Let's go ahead and wear these. We'll go ahead and wear these. We're going to harvest these. Get rid of these shoes. Nothing accessory wise. We're probably going to get rid of these and repair these. They're useless when wet. Not much use of the cold. Yeah, let's go ahead and actually go ahead and harvest this. Granted, it's probably better than what I have right now, but it's because it's not repaired. Wear it. Wear it. Look at all this garbage that we're wearing. Or that we're carrying around, rather. Harvest. Harvest. We'll get to the repairing here in a second. I probably don't need this anymore. So let's actually go ahead and uh, extinguish. We're gonna have to refuel it. Which is not a big deal. I think I need to lay down. I think you need to chill the F out. Fuel it. Okay, we're out of fuel now, which is fine. Oh, it's just destroyed. We actually just cannot fix it. I thought we were like out of uh, cloth or something, but it looks like it's just purely we can't fix it. All right, let's drink up. eat this rabbit meat that we found and let's actually repair everything else so if it breaks down you're you're basically just screwed where is the condition is that seven is that the condition let's go ahead and repair it can't repair while in the dark all right well let's sleep then uh, let's get eight hours we'll do eight We'll see how it looks in the, when we wake up. No more hour counting either. We have no idea like what time it is anymore. That's crazy to me. 
Couple more hours, maybe? Hello? Like, no more X out of our amount of hours of darkness or any of that other stuff. That's nuts. We're already low on water. Getting very, very thirsty. And now we can go ahead and repair some stuff. So, let's go ahead and just kind of go down the line. And repair whatever we need to repair. That has the lowest, uh, lowest life, basically. We suck, apparently. We can't even repair socks. There we go. Um, we're hungry as hell. It's a nice new sound. Let's go ahead and crack into a candy bar. I'd like to cook that meat today if possible. 45. We'll try and repair this. Let's hope. I mean, we'll get better at repairing the more we do it, basically. A 70% chance of success and we're still failing. I wonder what the percent chance of success in the socks was. We've used all of our cloth and we, we failed. We failed a lot. Alright. Well, let's get rid of these socks. Sounds like it's a quiet day out, which is good. Alright, let's take a look. 32%. You know what? Let's try and re Shit, man. Let's try and repair these. Please don't fuck up. Thank you. Repair these as well. Please, 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 please. Alright. We got some repairs in. Wasn't great. But it wasn't terrible. Take all the water. I'd rather not just make a wild, like, fire outside. I'd like to get to a place where there's... A fireplace or something. That'll come in handy. Where? Why? No. Take the book and let's get out of here. What is that? What is that fire? Like that fire thing? I don't understand. What does it mean? I'm gonna take these boots. We'll probably end up. Like, t destroying them and using them for something else, but... I mean, uh, it's not too bad out right now. The problem is, it's hard to see. I think I came from that way. I'm gonna go this way. Getting all turned around. I can't tell if it's a house over there. I basically just want to go where there are some buildings. That's a bear and two wolves. So that can suck my dick. Hell no. I think I hear a wolf whimpering. We're going to try and get down. We're good, we're good, we're good. My guess is that the wolf walked into the bear or something. Freaked out. Alright, I'm gonna try and cut through the diagonal because there's another wolf. There was a wolf over there. I think he may have turned up there. There's another wolf over there. So we're just gonna go to this dock over here. And just avoid... As much unnecessary confrontation as possible. Though, it, I will say, it didn't seem like that big of a deal when the wolf attacked me. Though, I assume if a bear attacks me, it's mostly I'm dead. I'm just dead. So I'm not going to bother risking it with a wolf near a bear or anything. Is that like a dead animal on the, on the ice? Is that a dead deer? It looks like it might be. Yeah, I think we got ourselves some food, boys! I hear footsteps in the snow. Where? Oh, okay. 
This is mine now, motherfucker. You're done. You are done. Get out. I'm taking it. Don't even care. Harvest it all. Can't feel my feet. God damn it. That's fine, because here's what we're going to do. Ah! I'm getting into that house right there. Okay. Huh. We're fine. We're going in. We're good. Don't mind me. Just gonna set this house on fire. New sports vest. All right. So we're basically gonna have to burn time here. I wish I could use this to cook, but. Uh, we're going to actually stop the episode here and say thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying. If you are, let me know in the comment section below by hitting the like button. Your support means the world to me. And as always, I'll see all of you next time. Bye-bye.